Thank you for joining this quick how-to screencast brought to you by Salesforce Support. To see more content like this, hit subscribe. In this video, you'll learn how to import data and create a data set in Salesforce Maps territory planning. If your org has territories and planning territories is tedious and time-consuming for your sales leaders, Salesforce Maps territory planning is the right product to easily plan efficient territories thereby improving sales and decreasing costs. To create a data set, you will first need to import data by either using reports or using SQL query. It's necessary to have the record ID field in the report being imported. For more information about record IDs and use VLOOKUP to match them in your import file, See these videos. We've put links to these in the short description of this video for you. You can also add numeric fields, such as annual revenue, to balance the territories on. Now, move to territory planning to create a data set. We will create a data set for you called US Healthcare. To create a new data set, click on Create Data Set. You'll then have to fill in the information and select a territory boundary you want to work with, such as U.S. Postal Codes. Now you'll select the data you wish to import. You can select multiple reports, search for reports, or create a custom SQL query by clicking on the Create Custom Query button. In this case, we will go ahead with the report we created. In this screen, you will map the fields from your data to territory planning. If your report does not contain the billing latitude and longitude, toggle the Import Object Fields button to import them from the object. You can now select the fields you would like to display in your data set, or select all fields. you now have the new U.S. Healthcare dataset. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or join us on the trail at trailblazer.salesforce.com.